when dealing with motion, one of the quantities, uh, a couple of quantities we deal with are work and energy. Okay, the focus here is to discuss the relationship between work and energy. Whenever we change one type of energy into another, work is going to be involved. Work is going to be involved in changing one type of energy into another, or of transferring energy from one object to another. That's when work is going to be involved. It is directly related to the force exerted in accomplishing that work. It is also directly related to the displacement along the direction of the exerted force. So if there is no motion, there is no work. You need to have motion for work to happen. If there is no force, there is no work. And again, work is what we need to do to change from one energy type to another energy type. Or for one object, it's not written here, but for one object to transfer energy to another object. Work needs to be done. The SI unit for work and energy, since they are interchangeable, is joules. That's what we use in SI units for work and energy, joules.